Black Mitch's ass boom part? No. Shoot. I'll speak with him again just to spite you all. Making sense with Dex's behavior. How was he being toxic? Tell me. How was he being toxic? <clears throat> it is good to see you again, Mio. By the aura you explode, it pains plains you have grown further as conjurer. Yes, I have. The time has come that you acquired yourself with the third element of your art, water. Give me Hazel's no I don't He said if she learns race she has to exile her Listen You will you will understand due time you will understand why he says that. I already know what happens in the story, but I will not spoil it. But you will understand why he tells you that. Or tells me that, because he's not telling you that. You're not a healer. I am. <laughs> the time has come that you acquire yourself with the third element of water. Okay. The first part of your lesson, you are to take his flask of Prince Teen's water and pour it at the foot of the hedge tree found near the Hawthorn Hurt. There's the water's purifier will draw forth the corruption identity and is siphoning the tree lives first. Dispatch the be this being and then speak with brother Joss at the heart of heart. Okay. As you might expect, he is a conjurer with a fine ear for a murmuring of brook and steam and stream. Listen well to his advice if you could would learn to master the elements of water. Okay. Let's go to save the forest. Is shroud again? Is shroud again? Okay. <clears throat> okay, you can't learn raise, or else you should just become like no. I'm worth a lot. I don't want to do that. Become monk, embrace the violence. <laughs> oh, I see it. I see it. I see it. I see it. I wonder, do I need to press? Yeah, there we go. Let's cleanse. Hello. Oh. Oh. Hello. Um. Hi. How you doing? But I just showered. Do you think that fighting like water with stone will help? <laughs> I mean, it seems to work, right? It's an element. There we go. Look, we did it. You know, I remember the first time I've been to here? I took pictures next to those flowers. But they're so pretty. And then next to those, because they're also very pretty. Maybe I can take some off stream, and then I'll post it on my Twitter. What's a tune? 
Whoa! Company rank up? What the fuck? What is that? It scared me. Your free company? Oh! My free co- <gasps> I can't even level down! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! And look at us! We live in two! <laughs> <laughs> This man can do anything? I have no clue. Okay. I tune. And not a level to do nothing with. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> the moment this is special it is special it's okay guys I am happy for us where is that mother flower there we go hello water boy <clears throat> greeting Mio brother is me inform me of your coming I assume it was you who perfect the be fouled water at the hedger. Yes, I have. The joy, joyous bubbling of the elemental was a pleasure to hear. On behalf of both of them and myself, I thank you. You're welcome. Oh, look at that hippo. God, she makes me feel important. Now, without further ado, let us speak with, of which, wait. Let us speak of that which Brother Isumi sent you to learn. I trust you uh, did not find it strange to be asked to tend to a tree when your lessons this day concerns the element of water. One need not have studied. Wait. One need not have studied. Not one need not have studied. Botany, to realize that the forest requires more than rich soil to flourish. Water is essential, essential for carrying the nutritious in the earth from a tree's roots all the way to the very tips of its leaf. This precious liquid is the lifeblood of the twelfth wood. Oh wow, that bird just now. Without it, not wood grow, but should it rise in the great volume, and too swiftly, the northern flow will become a crashing wave that wavers away before it. It is important to realize that all of nature is in balance. As conjury derives its power from nature, we must take, not, take care not to use our arts in a manner like to disturb its state. Ever must we be mindful of the ceaseless tug of war embodied in creation, this fruitful settlement of the element. Basically, as he said before, we are borrowing the power. We're not just using it to our own, like, pleasure, basically. Brother Jackin, are you, are you about? Imagine when you're like worried and you're like super nervous and you're kind of like, instead of like, cause like me when like I'm used to like from movies and stuff that I like that I've seen growing up and learning English, like people screaming, are you there? Or are you like, like, are you here? <laughs> are you about some so polite and so not panicky? That the only thing that feels panicky about it is the way that the text, like, thingy spikes are. I am here, sir. What has transpired? 
Oh, it's one of those useful, very useful guards. <clears throat> A haired on young antelope stage has gone berserk. I don't know what's got him so panicked, but there is no calming him now. The mad beasts gored the soldiers, send to shepherd them away from civil civilian settlements, leaving us with a pile of all wounded over. Oh my God! This English. Oh. Just just Jocelyn's power, and not enough hands to stretch the bleeding. We need a healer, and fast. I'm here. I'm here. Curious, I sensed nothing amiss in the whispering of the elements. What could have frightened those antelope so? Ah, apologizes. I should have revisit those musing anon. Let us make haste. Yes, let's run. I can heal. If matters are as chaotic as you say, I fear the numbers of injured may be raising as we speak. I doubt we have two, uh, that we too will suffice. We must divide our forces. Mio, travel straight forward, straightway to Jessalyn's Spire and tend the wounded. I shall endeavor the, to rally further healers and follow after you, bearing what restor restorative unguent I can. What? What? Got it. You, yes, sir, head to Steelgate, fan, Fane, and Bestitch the aid of Brother Isumi. Oh, drama has occurred! Let's go! Oh, it's very close by. Or not? The higher the level of more space in the chest and the higher actions you can activate. Okay, okay, okay. And basically what he's saying is keep hydrated, don't forget to drink. Milady Hug, are you about? No, I am not about. This is life. Orion just speaks, my Lady Hug, arts too present on me on the premises see like no matter how polite and nice it sounds it can never sound too panicky you know like are you about you can never ask it like are you about <laughs> like it doesn't sound like it's the correct way but i mean i know nothing of english so don't mind me just an outsider speaking about how English makes no sense to my brain sometimes. <clears throat> Who are you? A conjurer, you say? Praise Novkia. No, praise me. <laughs> no. <laughs> you have come not the moment too soon. Sound like you. Yet more wounded have just been carried in. Pray offer them what aid you can. What? Hello. Oh, oh. Uh, sir, are you okay? Um, yeah, he doesn't seem okay. Uh, do I just do that? Haha! -ha! I can breathe again! Thank you! You're welcome. Those folks are out of danger for the present, but I fear our reprieve shall be brief. The battle with the stags yet rages. And there are reports of yet more wounded. I bid you join the wood whalers and help out. Help put an end to it. Okay. <clears throat> Seek them just off the road that leads to the northeast. And do not worry. My art should be suffice to prevent matters from worsening here. Now go. Okay. Let's go. I'll save everyone. Or at least try to. Until Isumi comes and then he saves us all. Patch out! <laughs> okay. <laughs> this is not, did not go as planned. If 
but it's fine. Okay. It's old English, yeah. I str I struggled with it a lot. I didn't know of its existence before I played like before I played Final Fantasy. Z, what are those? Oh, they look old. They look lovely. <laughs> they look lovely. Not. Okay, I'll just yep. Oh, Sophie's here. Good. She can help us. Come to lend a hand, have you? Quickly! The fight is this way. Okay, let's go. You guys can do it. Oh, babies! Oof. I feel more said for like the animals than the humans to be honest. I love I love this monster in the game. Retreat! Conjure! Your aid! Yes, I shall not stand still. I shall aid. Okay, do I heal or do I attack? What do you guys say? The fact that no monster is on me, I think I need to uh, to heal. Oops. My bad. Need to heal, still attacking. <laughs> I mean, they look fine! Here. Let me heal that. Let me heal that. A little bit more of that, a little bit more of that, they look completely fine. Let's just mark all of them. Okay, water, okay. Man, I love this music. This makes me happy! Oh, the sound that the water has made. I like it. Oh, there's more? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Yeah, I ate that. I ate that. Okay, okay, okay. Hold on, hold on. Nope, I'm used to a different bar. Oh, he just screams that he need me. Come here. I also need you. Can you take the aggro? <laughs> Is anyone else healing? No, just me. Okay. I wonder, does this work on them? No, it doesn't. Okay. Oh! Let's go! I did it! Man, I'm so cute. Okay, sorry. Overdoing? Miss? I I'm fine. Don't mind me. Pray tell me that we are not too late. Oh, just a tiny bit. <laughs> oh, he looks unhappy about this all. Are you both? The concept between Gimme and 
game English. I mean, me basically butchering every second word in this game. The broken leg adds to the character development later. <laughs> heal the status, which rocks heal them to death. I don't think that's how it works. You need to do both. Because there are useless cards. Don't die. Only Sinner can raise you. Shinzo, you know nothing. You know nothing! You will see me do that job quest and you will understand in due time. But until then. This guy has horns. He's evil like Lala's. No. And you will see soon. Jesus. See, who is judging now? Did they ever judge you about having like a freaking cloak and like black stuff around you? Because like you're like black mage and like you're holding a freaking wand that just... Yes? Okay, never mind then. <clears throat> Anyways. Pray tell me we're not too late. I think she exhausted herself, healing so much. Sylphie, what have you done? I forbid you from using such... such methods. Guildmaster. I will not see you repeat your mother's mistakes. Uh oh, she's angry. My mother never did anything wrong. And off she goes. Mio, may I ask that you follow her, please? I fear my presence will only serve to provoke her further. She cannot have gone far in her weakened state. I just noticed how spiky his stuff is. Well, white mage always talk shit about moms or some. What the fuck? Shut the hell up and listen. Okay, you will see soon. You will understand in due time. You're still too young to understand. I don't understand. When I try to cast spells, nothing happens. When I reach for my power, there's just nothing there. Is this what the guild master was trying to warn me about? He said I was repeating my mom mother's mistakes. The same thing happened to her, losing her magic. I mean, and then she... Am I going to die? This can't be happening. I didn't think... Please, I need to be alone. Do we need to chase her even more? No, we need to report to Isumi, who is back at his guild. Okay, good luck being alone. Don't die. See you later. Bye-bye. <clears throat> Isumi is actually a black man in disguise. I hope not. That is a big flag of white. That's fine. Okay. This is fine. This is fine. It's so me. She ran away from us. She wanted to be alone, more like. She didn't run away from us. She can't avoid us. We chose to let her go. So if she dies, it's on her. <laughs> it's not me. Mio, have you, you have returned at least. Were you able to speak with Sylphie? No, I wasn't. 
follow my pillow a bit. I see. I once taught you that conjurers harness the power of nature, that we might bring about change. Earth, wind, water, healing. The principle is no different. For the art of mending, we draw on the boundless life force of nature, and we bestow it upon the wounded. Selfie has never sought to borrow from that bounty. Her power to heal stems from her own life force. Shinzo. The vital energies of mortals are, however, finite. Finite. And now that which I most fear has come to pass. Her mother unwittingly took her own life through the continued use of her healing skills. And Selfie's aptitude for her art for the art is, if anything, even greater, though it is not unexpected that she should reach the limits of her strength at much earlier age. If we do not intervene, this terrible tragedy will be repeated, and I, for one, could not bear to see the child suffer the same fate as her mother. Shinzo, I shall think on a solution to this dark dilemma. It may be that I have need of your assistance in the near future, Mia. Do not doubt your abilities. You are a conjurer who has passed the trials of earth, wind, and water. You grow closer to nature with every passing day, and I sense within you the seeds of greatness. In your encounter with water, you learned its role as a bringer of life, but you also felt the impeccable power of a surging wave as it swept you along its path. Like earth and wind, and nature at large, the element of water is possessed of more than one aspect. Having completed the third lesson, I am satisfied that you have mastered the fundamentals of conjury. Yet this is but the beginning of your journey. Henceforth, you must strive to attune yourself even more closely to the elements and to nature. Let's take that one. So basically dark magic? No! <laughs> Level up! <laughs> Ooh, I'm purple now! <gasps> oh, I'm so cute! Oh, I love it! I'm like, mm hmm. The reason he didn't want her to use rise is because it takes a lot of mana and she will basically die. Which is why she needed to learn to borrow from the nature in order to not like waste her life by healing other people. Oh, you got races? Yes. You got it to level 12. Oh, dark. Casting dark spells don't do that. Odd. Oh, yeah, we'll say about that. You know what? I will do the... I will do the Tamaguchi... Like, job quest. Just to spite you. <laughs> to see how bad it is. Better question why is he hiding that from her? He's not. He tried to warn her a couple of times. He's like, listen, you need to learn the other stuff. Don't use this magic. I've told you a lot of times. You need to learn the other elements. You need to understand the nature. 
But she refuses because she's like, no, I'm gonna be like my mom. And now you know that her mom died. Wasn't that a level 15 quest? Yes. But I got fries like without the quest. Like I didn't get anything, like any skill from the quest so far. No, you are kid, give me no, you. Please, then you'll know they're epic. He didn't tell her why. He did! Or that her own mom died from using it. You know what? You just need to, you just need to, to see what I'm doing and you will learn from it. Don't worry about it. Because I will do... You know what? I can do all of the job quests on stream. How about that? Huh? How about that? I'll be as kind as to do that. And then I'll make a YouTube video with all of them together. Because <laughs> I'm that kind. To... Okay, now I can go and do the botanist class for Ditty. Ditty! <laughs> it's probably busy. But let's at least unlock it. Yes? What was that? Who did this? Hey, look, you may. Not you may, you may. Okay, now I can do it. Oh, so kind, I know, right? <laughs> you should do your Genshin Dales and go to bed. No, I still have a little bit more time. Don't worry about it. I'm keeping looking at the clock. Okay. <clears throat> Hello and welcome to the Botanist Guild. What brings you here today? Hmm? Interested in becoming a botanist, are you? Blit! Thank you so, 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 so much for the raid. Hello, how was your stream? You kid. Akumi is awesome. Akumi is awesome indeed. Very, very awesome. Okay. Then you've come to the right place at our guild. You can study under some of the finest botanists in all realm. In anticipation and tasting proposing, is it not? Ahem. <clears throat> So, what says you? Would you like to add your name to our role? Yes. Excellent. Now you're doubly eager to dive headlong into the nearest shrubbery. But first, a brief explanation on the origins of the Botanist Guild. Our guild boasts a long history. Its roots can be tracked back some 500 years to when our nation was still in, in, in its infancy. It was around that time that a precursor organization to our own was established to facilitate common with the elements. Is this gonna be long? But I suspect you're already confused, yes. Not being first firstborn, let me put it in a way that your kind will understand. Thank you. That Wellswood doesn't belong to men, but almighty beings known as the Elemental. It is by their leave that we Gridanians dwell here in the forest, and it is by their leave that we receive of its bounty. Ever since mankind settled in the Twelfth Wood, it has been necessary for us to obtain elemental permissions prior to taking aught from their domain historically. This was a rather involved process in that only a precious few could actually commune with them. Specifically, those conjurers blessed with the ability to hear the elementals Apparently known as the hearers. Probably two hours. Stop it! It's not two hours. In order to rely the element the elementals will wait, in order to rely the elementals will to the botanist in a more timely manner, a new organi organization was formed with the hearer as its mouth and ears. This organization would eventually evolve to become the Botanist Guild. To this day, the guild employs at the service of a hearer 
who offers guidance to our members. Yet this is no longer our organization's sole concern. We also stick to promulgate, promulgate? correct harvesting practices. That is, practice which honor the will of the elemental. And that, my friend, is the story of our guild came to be. I trust you have a newfound appreciation for our work, for the work we do. Yes, for sure. Then to leave all our best friends, let the geek into this much I hope your like stream went well and everything. You're great. Okay, I miss you. Okay. Three bunnies was almost more than she could handle. <laughs> I have a shot of freaking amazing kill screen. What? Monster and Hunter Lives? Nice! Then if you think earlier, seems like we have already stepped away. Wait, seriously? <gasps> this is really good. They probably seen the like really really bad stuff. And they were like, listen. This is not good for nature. This is the least thing you want to do. <clears throat> now. With all this talk of elementals and communing, I'm happy you're wondering whether you're fit to join us. Well, you may cast such doubts aside. You don't need to have been raised a good little for Forestburn girl to be a botanist, nor do you need to know the secrets of Forestburn salute. I just... you. You just need a healthy respect of for nature and the will to learn. If you honestly believe you possess those things, I would be, it will be my pleasure to recommend you to our guildmaster. Please wait a moment while I see the formalities. Speak to me again when you're ready to begin enrollment procedures. Okay, let's speak with you again. Ready to enroll? Yeah, I take it. Yes, I do. Music to my ears. It will be my pleasure to refer you to the guildmaster Fufucha. Our guildmaster knowledge of nature is a second to known. <clears throat> One need only witness her uncanny knacks for spotting the finest timber to see that hers is a truly God-given talent. It is for this reason that she holds the title of First Votanist. Oh, but you need not to be overworked. Over wit, over uh, wit. For she is the kindest of souls. You will find the guildmaster just outside the building, seek her out, and impress her with your desire to become a botanist. Okay. Hello, guildmaster. I'm Fufucha, the master of this guild. Pleased to make your acquaintance. I take it, Leonciolet. Lancelot has given you an overview of botany already? Well, I suppose I had better continue where he left off. Oh my god, there's more text! All botanists may rightly claim to share a close relationship with nature, but none so intimate as that of the botanist. It is our calling to nurture the natural environments to the mutual benefit of men and wood. Loot. <clears throat> I mean, what? Um, but even as nature holds us in her loving embrace, providing for our every need, she is at the heart of unsentimental creature. One that will take life just as readily as she gives it. Okay. Being a botanist means coming face to face with, the un with this uncomfortable truth. On a regular basis, knowing this, do you still wish to, wish to walk our path? Yes. The look in your eyes bespeaks the passion in your heart. Very well, I bid you welcome to the Botanist Guild. To help you on your way, I present you with this hatchet. Take it up, and then present yourself to me again. I would assign you your first task as a Botanist as the, of the Guild. Thank you. Okay. Class in change, thank you very much. And it has begin. Not this one. Shit. Okay, wait, hold on. Gathering log obtained! Let's fucking go. Wait a second. 
Uh, plus. Thank you very much. And... Hajit. <laughs> I'm naked in it. Nice! Thank you. And... Me one. Thank you very much. That's it. Okay, I am now a botanist. Please tell me all the things. I see you have your hatchets on you. Very good. <clears throat> a botanist hatchet is... His livelihood. Never forget this. If you fail to keep its blade clean and keen, your effort will yield naught but sweat and splinters. But let us see about your first task. Ah yes, to help you grasp the basics of botany, I would like you to gather ten pots of worth oh, pots worth of latex. The forest yields to us many and more sources. It is the botanist's job to know what can be found and where. If it's latex you require, <clears throat> Deti, this is an important part, you would do so uh, well to search just outside the blue badge gate or the yellow spread gate. Seek out the, ma the mature trees that stands in those areas and then put your hatchets to use. I wish you well. Now, I'll tell you what. Basically, in the quest, it kind of like tells you which area do you need to go to. She's also cute while teaching. I feel like I stop a lot and I feel like I'm very noobish, but there are some stuff that I kind of know, so I'm kind of like, oh yeah, I can help with that. So I, I try, but I, I'm still like, I'm kind of like, I, I can help, but I hope I help. Okay. Let's see what I say. How goes the guttering effort? Least you forget, Latex can be had just outside the blue... Okay. We're handing the Latex over. No, you're great. No, you. Ah, yes. Precisely 10 points of Latex. Just as I instructed. You have done well. Latex is easy to find and equally easy to harvest. As such, collecting the stuff is an ideal task for young botanists who are learning their way around the hatchet. Oh, she's so cute. Yet, know that being able to swing said tool does not make you a botanist. You must also possess the knowledge to locate the resources you seek. That will be all for me for the present. I urge you to keep hoarding your senses and skills as botanist. Gather near and far and learn from your experiences. I look forward to seeing you again when you have become a better acquainted with our trade. Till then, I bid you a happy gathering. Awesome. And with that, we're done with the first part of Bodenist. And now I have many things in my inventory, just like as it should be. Because <laughs> this is how I play the game. Uh, 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 um. Bedtime! Oish, oish, oish. Like, it's only if you have a house or in the FC house or something, or at your friend's place. Ha oh, hello! Oh, hello! Oh! Hello! I think Cole can use them. Yeah, but. Hello! Stop staring. Never. <laughs> that way you don't. I, from my experience, no other uh, crafter that I've leveled that so far is level 50 uses them. So the moment it will just plug your inventory, I feel like. Level Tamaguchi, please, thank you. <laughs> Sure, the post office. Mm -mm. 
Respectfully looking. That's all. Mm -mm. You should disagree with. 